sometimes it doesn't load the memory card. That's kind of crazy. Oh, am I live? Hello, fellow heroes. I'm Action Smack Chanda, two in one hero, made up of a virus from the 70s, and a guy who likes to play things. And welcome to the new Pixel Smack Chan Gaming Channel. <laughs> um, if you're new to uh, all things that are Action Smack Chan, uh, well, welcome, <laughs> first of all. I'm glad that you could be here, fellow hero. Also, this is a gameplay channel, uh, but the main channel is still Action Smack Chan. And we're still going to continue doing reviews, maybe some essays, some kind of whatever else that is not gaming. But this channel, Pixel Smack Chan, is going to do Pixel Smack Chan things by playing games, translating this game. I actually kind of forgot to um, charge my phone today, but I, we might be able to get through the next uh, three hours with a uh, 50% battery. If we can't um, try to figure something out, <laughs> it's the entire show. Uh, but anyway, we're not here to talk about that. Let's just get in it. It's smack time. I'm gonna start this new chapter. See here, I'm gonna bump up the uh, gain on the game a little bit because I know there's probably gonna be some narration in the background and maybe some of us will want to hear it. Um, if you are able to translate it for us, do so in the comments, let us know what it means. I don't know what any of it means, man. Something, something memory. All right. あしたの星には明日の人間が住むと人は言う。いつも夜空には明日を信じる明日の星が数限りなく輝いていると人は言う。I <笑> love the narration, but gosh darn it is a hard to uh, get translated. <笑> Uh, even when I was uh, doing these these episodes um, pre-recorded, and back when I was doing these uh, episodes pre-recorded, um, I had a hard time translating the uh, the voiceover there because I didn't have any subtitles, so I couldn't just uh, uh, translate the subtitles, which means I had to rely on the microphone, and. Um, that that on its own is pretty finicky. <laughs> it's hard to pick up. Well, anyway, uh, Mr. Conductor, the next stop is tomorrow's star. The stop will be for two weeks. We're not taking my input. Hold on. There we go. Mitel says. Tetsuro, leave your warrior's gun in the 3 9. Doste? Huh? Why? It's not just guns. It's not okay to say anything about the mechanized. Man, or even the Galaxy Express. I guess they just are not into technology wherever we're about to land. Kind of ironic for a place called Tomorrow's Star. <laughs> More like yesterday's rock. You know what I mean? Why? It's a rule of the Galactic Railroad Agreement. There are happy people living here who don't know anything. Oh, they just don't want to uh, introduce a new technology to the planet. <laughs> happy people who don't know anything. <laughs> Tetsuro's all, Tetsuro all like, who doesn't know anything? The 
good looking planet though. Very blue. Ooh, the music's on. <laughs> mm. Ooh, this place sounds and looks like a great time. Or it it kind of looks like a whole lot of other planets that we've been to in terms of layout. <laughs> Wow, it looks like the old Earth I saw in the photo. What photo? Pictures in general, I suppose. Yeah. It feels nostalgic, even. I feel, even though it's my first time, I feel nostalgic. <laughs> Oh, Tetsura and his uh, ten-year-old boy nostalgia. Tetsuro, onaka ga suita desho. Ramen tabeyoka. Tetsuro, you're hungry, right? Shall we eat some ramen? <laughs> Tetsuro has been down in the ramen lately. Ramen? Taberu, taberu. Come on. Google translate. <laughs> Ramen, let's eat, let's eat. All right, man, this planet rocks already. <laughs> and we had that entire anime cutscene just to. Watch Tetsuro eat ramen. Let's see here, looks like I am dropping frames again. I don't know why I've been having so much trouble with it lately. I might actually have to restart my router. Um, we'll try to deal with it for now. Hmm. But if the problem persists, I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna pause the stream later and uh try to fix whatever's going on with the uh, router. <laughs> Well, 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 I'll keep my eye on it, guys. I'll keep my eye on it. It's delicious. It's ramen. Oh. Accidentally clicked off. There we go. Oh, thank you. And the harmony between the chewy texture of the noodles. Whoa, hey. Come on, focus Google, we can get through this, even if my internet does not want to, we can. Just translate, please. The harmony between the chewy texture of the noodles and this deep soup is truly an eternal friend of mankind. <laughs> um, when did Tetsuro get so, in, so intellectual about ramen? Uh, what are you exaggerating? <laughs> no, this is actually the first time I've had such a delicious ramen. Oh, rest in peace, last ra ra ramen shop guy. Oh, that's enough. I'm going to leave. Uh, but I still don't praise it. Oh gosh. Everyone freaking out about it. Okay, you don't have any money, right? Uh, just leave the money for the ramen. Uh, Blue Infinity 22 is working, but he's here. Thanks for coming by. Thanks for showing your uh, support. And thanks for joining in our first stream on the new channel. 
let's see here. I am still streaming to the Twitch as well. That's right. Uh, it's just that the uh, on YouTube side, we are now Pixel Smack Chan as opposed to the you know main channel. Let's see here. Tetsuro says, huh? Why? See, I'll pay. I'll pay for his promotion. <laughs> mm, man, jamming, jamming to the Galaxy Express. <laughs> what was that? It's such a rough store. See, that old man mistook Tetsuro for a poor kid. Or a poor student? Poor student? Let's see here. Yes, I don't have any money, but... but there are students studying hard for their dreams. Uh, do I look like a poor student? Well, at the very least, Tetsuro does look like a little kid. Mostly because he is. Like 12 tops. I'm sure that old man likes young people like that. Uh, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> I don't know how to uh, read that so that doesn't sound strange, but I'm pretty sure she doesn't mean it in a weird way. <laughs> He's a nice person. Tetsu, are you still dissatisfied? No, I'm full. Shall we go to the park then? Yeah! Oh my gosh, look at Tetsuro chilling! I like the chilling Tetsuro model. That's the best animation. Ah, what a pleasant planet. Now oh, that's a relief. Yeah. The ramen is delicious, the people in town aren't too noisy, and it's just a great planet. You seem to like this planet. You know, it is pretty convenient that the planet where he's not allowed to bring his uh, warrior's gun is totally chill. Look at him relaxing. It's more relaxing to be in a world where you don't have to shoot people. Go figure. This might be the happiest pl planet in the universe. So, ne. Ironically, cooler than a place with paradise law. Yes, says Maytel. <sighs> Somehow, when I felt happy, I start to feel sleepy. Uh, the weather is nice, so let's take a nap here. Mm. Okay. Tetsuro's down for taking a nap. Look at him. Look at both of them. Oh my gosh. Maytel, don't lose your don't lose your bag over this. Can't be napping in public, losing your bag. Maytel, that thing has something in it. Tetsuro, it's Tetsuro, please wake up. Uh, uh. 
たの、uh, what happened? パスを取られた My pass was taken. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Usually we could be all like Tetsuro, look what you've done, but this one's also on Maytel. She took a nap. She, she got too comfortable. She knows what the universe is like. Huh? While I was sleep, I mean, while you were sleeping, Tetsuro. <laughs> while I was sleeping, I lost my money. All my money. Oh no, I thought it was a happy planet and was completely caught off guard. Anyway, even so, which one? I'm having a hard time finding it. What about the police? Contact the police. Hopefully, the police can do something. No, it's a secret that the Galaxy Express is operating here due to a secret agreement. Oh, <laughs> that is a pickle. You can't tell the authorities about your Galaxy Express pass, they're not allowed to know about the Galaxy Express. But what happens if the pass can't be found? Uh, we're going to live here. Oh, that's so. Let's see, we have two week. We have two weeks to stop, so I have to get my pass back in that time. I like how it was Maytel who got her pass stolen too. I'm pretty sure. Um, was Maytel. It doesn't mean to say Maytel lost her pass. Because sometimes Google Translate kind of has a hard time with uh, pronouns. <laughs> Getting yous and me's mixed up. Let alone he and she. Let's see here. I'm looking for the culprit. What should I do? Uh, there's not even a Galactic Railway uh, Secretariat on. This planet. So, uh, how about on your own? So, you have to figure it all out yourself. This planet is starting to seem like a scary place. See, Tetro, anything's fine. If you notice anything, please let me know. You got it. Am I controlling? Oh, no, not controlling Tetro yet. There's nothing missing other than the pass and the money. There's no evidence that the keyhole was forced open. Wow, Tetsuo's really doing the uh, detective work right now. <laughs> uh, he is a pretty clever kid. He's all like, you know what, let me go check if somebody actually forced this thing open. They had to have broken open this lock here. Huh? How did the culprit get this key? This bag looks antique on the outside, but inside is a... It has a super high-tech special lock. What does this mean? Uh, 
How did you open this bag? Uh, check the keyhole, and there wasn't a single scratch left. Can this key be opened with the scientific power of this planet? No, it would be impossible even for the top level engineers of this planet. They would not be able to figure out this lock. So the culprit was on the Galaxy Express like us? So, Yes, but there are other ways to come onto this planet. Maybe another train? <laughs> Besides, if you're a passenger on the Galaxy Express, there's no need to steal your pass or money. Because you already have a pass and money yourself. Logic. It's like catching a cloud. Finding a strife. Yeah. But if we don't catch the cloud in two weeks, uh, we'll be living on this planet for the rest of our lives. Ooh, an Obasan. What is it? You guys are opening your bags in a place like this? No, it's just a little... And my wallet was stolen while I was sleeping. Oh, are you stealing something? Did you report it to the police? No, that's a bit... It seems like there's a reason. Let's see. Oh, don't fall asleep, phone. Let's see. Have you guys eloped? It doesn't look like they're siblings, but maybe they're siblings? Hi. Or, yeah. Your siblings who don't look alike? It looks like you're on a trip, but... Wanna translate? Do you have a place to stay? No, I don't. Well, then come to my place. I'm running a boarding house. But money, we have none of that. <laughs> It's okay, I have a spare room anyway. Gosh, you're able to find some really nice people in space. Well then, by the way... Yeah, thank you, miss. It's okay. Yeah, we are running into the nicest people in space. I have a pretty good track record. <laughs> I didn't have to shoot anybody lately, not for the past couple chapters. And it's a good thing that we were able to just leave our weapons on the train. Because if we're able to find such chill people. Can't get free ramen, though. 
That was for the that was for the previous chapters. It's here, don't come in. Or is it it's here? Do come in. Well, is that another Toshiro? Ah, Oh, oh, we don't. Oh, it's oh, we don't. <laughs> now, these people will be staying here for a while. Are you new? No, they're just staying here for a while for some reason. Uh, Come on, translate. He's introducing himself, darn it. I want to know how he does it. Let's see here. Name is Oidon Oyama. Nice to meet you. My name is Tetsuro Hoshino. It's nice to meet you. I'm his sister, Meiko Hoshino. Nice to meet you. Oh, look at that. She made up her own name. <laughs> How adorable. Siblings? Hey, don't be shy. Hurry up and show me to the to an open room on the second floor. Show them to an, to the open room in the second floor. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Oidon doesn't know how to handle being in the presence of such a cute girl like Maytel. Or <laughs> Mako. And this is your room. Two weeks in this room. I didn't realize Tetsuro had such high standards for rooms. I didn't think that he would be like a picky type. What do you mean? He seemed dissatisfied with Isoro's appearance. See, I have no complaints, right? Maytel? Or, man. Tetsuro, you need to get with a picture. She's not Maytel, she's Meiko. Maytel. <laughs> no, a big sis Mako. Eh. Yeah. Well, it's a small room, but if you live in the capital, you can say that. Yeah. That's helpful. Well, if you have any trouble, I'll be next to you. Thank you. <laughs> All right, really interesting again, because this does not reflect any episodes of Galaxy Express 39 that I remember. Um, and I think Oidon is the main character of his own manga. I think I've seen like um, pictures of him before. All right. And I have control over Tetsuro again. All right. And I am seeing that I am once again having trouble 
uh, with my frame drops. Um, actually, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and try to mess around with my router a little bit. Um, so I'm going to pause the stream. I'm going to be right back in maybe around 10 minutes as soon as I can. Uh, just because I don't want the first stream on this channel to just be a chopped up piece of mess. <laughs> so I'm going to go see what I can do. Um,